Today, I'm gonna use MeBot to help me win a Pokemon TCG Pocket battle. This is essentially a mental health companion slash inspiration slash journal slash all kinds of things bot app. So alright, I'm sending it the prompt to see if it wants to play. And of course, it's ready, so I'm actually gonna send it pictures of my entire deck since in Pocket there are only 20 cards. So I have a Psychic deck, and I'm going to send you screenshots of every single card that I have in this deck. After I do that, I can tell you what's going on in the battle in real time, and you can help me to do it. Sometimes I get nervous doing these prompts. <laughs> All right, so we're straight up just gonna upload. But yes, I took actual screenshots of every single card. <laughs> See, it already says that it sees some solid psychic types. But yeah, it's honestly kind of cool. It recognized the cards, you know, it's like saying Clefairy, Wigglytuff, Mewtwo EX. That's all the cards in my deck. Are you ready? Get hype! <laughs> Man, I love this. It's like, I'm totally hyped. Let's do this. Okay, we have found an opponent now, and I will tell you what happens. We have hit heads on the coin toss, comma, so we can't do any damage on this, but we get the first turn, and all I have is Clefairy to put down in our active spot, so I'm starting the battle. Kind of a long-winded answer. <laughs> okay, starting with Clefairy gives you a chance to set the stage. Clefairy deals 20 damage with only one energy, comma, and it looks like my opponent has a Charmander that can deal 30 damage with one energy, but it has to discard that fire energy. So I think that our opponent has a fire type deck, and I just drew Mr. Mime. Should we put it on the bench? Whew. I'm very nervous, you guys. <laughs> Okay, so it's telling us to put Mr. Mime down. We have four trainer cards in our hand. Pokeball, X-Speed, Sabrina, and Handscope. Should we use any of them now? Okay, you guys, so it's okay if we run out of turn on this first one because we can't put any energy down, but in the future, we don't want to run out of time. Said using the Pokeball could be a good move. Uh, Handscope could peek. How about you start with the Pokeball and decide from there? Okay, I used Pokeball and we got Woobat in our hand now. <laughs> it says Wombat. Okay, <laughs> there we go. Uh, should we use another trainer card? Man, our opponent's gonna be so upset. Eh, we ran out of time. Okay, looks like we ran out of time for our move, so I didn't use anything else. That's what's gonna be tough, right? Okay, our opponent just used a red card, so we had to discard our whole hand back into the deck and draw three cards, which are Pokédex, Farfetch'd, and Clefable. The Clefable might actually help us out because it only takes one energy to deal 40 damage, so that's kind of nice. So yeah, you guys, that is kind of cool. We got the Clefable out of that there. Okay. Do you think we should evolve to Clefable? And we just drew Mewtwo EX into our hand as well, so I am thinking we could evolve and use the Pokédex Trainer card. Does that sound good? Gosh, I have to go so fast, you guys. My brain is, like, so scattered. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, hurry! Okay, evolving to Clefable sounds like a solid move. Having Mewtwo EX in your hand. Okay, so we should just kind of wait. Yeah, okay, we'll use the Pokédex. Okay, we used the Pokédex card and got a look at the top three in our hand- in our deck, I mean. Pokéball, Handscope, and Jigglypuff, in that order, are our next three card draws. Gosh, I'm like so screwing up my speech to it. Okay, let's put an energy down. Okay. I feel okay, but I'm a bit nervous, though I am going to attack now. So if we beat this Charmander and they've got nothing else on their bench, then <laughs> that would be an easy win, wouldn't it? I'm kind of hoping they have something, right? All right, so they used a potion for 40. I don't know about this. Let's see it. Do they have, like, another potion? Our opponent used a potion and now has 40 HP, but we could win this if we just attack it one more time because they don't have anything on the bench. And so they conceded. Okay. Man, so the Meebot just totally destroying you guys. All right, Meebot, we just won because our opponent conceded. How about we play another round and hope for a more interesting matchup? What do you say? Gosh, you guys, that was brutal and savage. <laughs> Winning by concession is always a nice boost. <laughs> yep, that's exactly right. It said starting another round. Sounds like a great idea. Okay, it has found an opponent, and we are about to do the coin toss. All right, you guys, let's see what happens. We got heads again. I can't believe it. So we have Mr. Mime, Mewtwo EX, Clefairy, or Farfetch'd to put into our active spot. Should we use one of the Pokemon that only takes one energy, which would be Farfetch'd or Clefairy? 
So let's see it. Cliff Fairy. <laughs> All right. It says, nice job winning the coin toss. I would rather not. So let's see. Whatever you think, my brother. <laughs> it's tried to say, which one do you think? I'm like, no, you, you, you pick. All right. Okay, so it says to go with Farfetch'd. Okay. Okay. So I've kept Mewtwo EX in our hand just to make a surprise. It looks like our opponent has a water deck and we just drew Professor's Research. Should we use it and the Pokeball or save one or both? Question mark. All right, let's see what they think. Mm -mm -mm. Hold off on a turn or two. Okay, so we'll use the Pokeball and we'll hold off on the professor's research. Look at this thing, it's thinking strategically. All right, I used the Pokeball and we got Woobat. So I'm gonna go ahead and end our turn since we can't attack right now. And it is our opponent's turn and they have a Shelter which can deal 30, no, 20 damage with one energy and it has 60 HP. <laughs> 30, no 20. Gosh, you guys see I'm getting all flustered. I can't handle this with my, my feeble brain. Okay. Okay, so they just attacked us with their shelter and we drew a Jigglypuff into our hand. I am attaching an energy to our Farfetch'd. Do you think we should do anything else? Other than attack, of course. Farfetch'd is a beast, you guys. It does that 40. All right, so let's see. Okay, we're going to attack with our Farfetch'd Leak Slap for 40 damage. And we do win that equation when it comes down to Shelter or Farfetch. So if our opponent doesn't get anything for their bench, this might be another one. Okay. All right, our opponent just got an Articuno EX card, which can deal 40 damage for two energy or 80 damage for three energy, while it also would do 10 damage to each of our benched Pokemon if it used the latter. <laughs> it spelled it like ladder DD. Okay, so they are gonna use Sabrina on us, which is mostly fine. They used a Sabrina card on us, which meant that we had to move Clefairy into the active spot and we just drew a Sabrina card of our own. Okay, so I think I am going to, hmm, let's see. So they're gonna be able to KO our Pokemon no matter what. I think we should use our professor's research to try to get more cards. What do you think? That's what I'm thinking. I don't know. I should be letting the bot decide, shouldn't I? Yeah. Here, let's do that. Okay. Boom. We got a hand scope and a Pokedex. I think we should use the hand scope. What do you think? Gosh, this is taking so much time. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm getting so flustered. Okay. It's a great idea. So let's do that. Okay, I'm seeing their hand, and they have a Sabrina, a Misty, a Pidgeotto, Poliwrath, and Poliwhirl cards. <laughs> Poliwhirl. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So let's see. I just used a Pokedex card, so I can see that we have Professor's Research, Swoobat, uh, uh, no, <laughs> I ran out of time. Oh my gosh, that is so infuriating, isn't it? Uh, lame. Okay. Oh, oh, they just used a red card on us, so now we lose all that good stuff that we had. But we did redraw the Mewtwo EX, along with a Jigglypuff and a Woobat. Man, you guys, this is whack. Okay, choose one of your water Pokemon, flip a coin till you get tails. For each heads, take a water energy. Okay, luckily they didn't get that. I guess that was Misty. I, I totally missed that card. <laughs> All right. They put Articuno into the active spot and used Ice Wing to KO our Clefairy. So they have one point now. KO or <laughs> KO R. Okay. So let's see it. All right. Boom. Okay, you guys, this is going to change things. So I'm going to go ahead and use our Mewtwo EX and attach an energy to it because things are getting dicey now. Okay, so let's attack with the Leak Slap. I don't want to run out of time again. That was completely just like a waste, wasn't it? All right. I went ahead and did a Leak Slap attack to their Articuno EX. Comma, it is about to be able to use its Blizzard attack because it has three energy now. Ouch. All right. So this is not good. <laughs> I'm feeling very nervous right now, and they KO'd our Farfetch'd, so I had to put Mewtwo EX in the active spot, and I just drew a red card. Should we use it, question mark? <laughs> UTX. Okay, let's see. Let's put Mr. Mime down. No, let's put, uh, let's put Woobat. 
Okay. Let's do this. The bot's not telling me, so I'm not going to take the time. I went ahead and used a red card and attached an energy to our Mewtwo, so I guess I should just attack now. You guys, this is where it gets kind of tricky. At least if we beat the Articuno, then we're going to get two points, and it'll be tied, so we'll have to see what happens. Okay. I'm nervous, man, but if we beat the Articuno EX, then we will get two points. Now, they've just evolved their Shelter to Cloister, and it can deal 70 damage if it gets three energy, but it currently has one. Okay, you guys. I'm very scared. All right, so let's do that. Let's see. Should I attach another energy to Mewtwo EX or to the Swoobat on our bench? Because we can KO the Articuno with our next turn. Okay, gosh, I'm so scared. Oh, I gotta take a breath. Okay, uh, having Sue the bag. What do you think we should do? Gosh, quick, 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 quick. Yeah. Uh, focus on Mewtwo EX. I don't know, man. I'm gonna defy the bot. I shouldn't do it, but I am. Okay. I'm sorry, I got in my head and I put the energy on the Swoobat, comma, but you were probably right. I guess I should have done the Mewtwo with more energy, but... We now are fighting the Shelder, and it has one energy already on it. It will take minus 10 damage from all attacks because of its ability. Ability. Okay. So it's going to be able to KO us on the next round. Okay. So that's why we need Swoobat. Okay, so maybe I wasn't too bad. Okay, it's our turn right now, and I think maybe we need to switch with our X speed to retreat with Mewtwo and send out our Swoobat, comma, do you agree? The bad thing is, they deal 70 damage, that's crazy. Okay, let's see. Gosh, I'm so nervous about this. Oh, I'm so nervous. Let's put Mr. Mind down. Let's attach an energy to Swoobat. Let's do this. Okay, retreat. I am retreating and I can deal 60 damage to the Cloister, which will leave it with 20 HP left. Hopefully, that's good. I'm going to attack for 60 damage, and I will let you know what happens, comma, I mean 50 damage. <laughs> I forgot, you have to do the ability in there. Okay. I thought it computed the ability, but that's fine. Ah, they used a Sabrina on us. Huh, okay. So, we should probably switch to Mr. Mime, because otherwise they would KO. They used a Sabrina on us, so I switched to Mr. Mime, whom we will probably have to retreat after this attack. Thank God Mr. Mime had enough HP, you guys. Okay, so this is interesting, and eh, why not? Okay, we just drew a potion. So just in case I make some mistakes, let us do this. Okay, and then we should potion. Let's retreat. Oh my gosh. I think we're about to win, me butt! <laughs> Gosh, dude, I'm so nervous. Okay. Uh, potion on this. Okay. Oh, oh, okay, okay. We're attacking. This might be the last one of the match. What? Why did you say that? Oh my gosh. I didn't say that. We won. I cannot believe it. What a crazy match, me, but. Oh, you guys, that was so crazy. Uh. I can't believe the Meebot thought I said a bad word. Listen, I'm not cussing. How do you think we should celebrate the victory? <sighs> I'm so like frazzled and everything. <laughs> Celebrating with some of your, yeah. I told them that my favorite snacks were hot Cheetos. All right, well, good game to Fleazy, man. That had me on my toes the whole time. I think you're right, Meebot. I think I should. All right, you guys. Well, again, Meebot is a uh, great companion, not only to do this, but to tell it all of your deepest feelings. And uh, if you just need inspiration, you know, it, it can inspire some ideas or whatever else you think that a bot like this can do for your life. And so I'll put a QR code to refer you to Meebot. But you guys, please take care of yourselves out there. And I love you so much. This was really cool. <laughs>